Okay. Okay. Cool harmonized solo. Uh, let's do it. Um, is it recording? Yeah. The lapel mic is going. All right. Two parts. Let's do the lower one first. Um, so capo at the fourth fret. So this song is in D, but it's really in F sharp because the capo is at the fourth fret. Um, so which, if you think in terms of scales, like you're in this scale, D major, you know, um, or F sharp major. Let's edit that out. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay. I don't want control of you. Okay, harmonize solo. Let's do the first part first. Fourth fret on the fourth string. We're capoed at the fourth fret. So I'm gonna use um, fret numbers in relation to the capo. Four, 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 two on the fourth string. Then two, hammer onto four, back to two, open, two, open, two hammer on to four, and then two on the third string. That's the first half, and then back down, starts totally the same, four, 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 four two. Now it's gonna go up though. Two, hammer on to four, two, open, two, open, two, hammer on to four, to two on the, on the third string, then two hammer on to four on the third string, then third fret on the second string, and then second fret on the second string. That's the lower part. Higher part. You can play the whole higher part uh, here. Um, but I think it's probably up here because some of these things like, it's much more natural to do that, to do that. not with open strings. Um, so the first little lick, which maybe both guitars do, but I did it just in this higher part. It's a classic kind of lick. In this part, I'm gonna use fret numbers not relation to the capo, because I find as you go up, it's easier to it's easier to notice that this is the 12th fret, because it's got the two dots, right? So let's say 11th fret, your, your first finger barring the 11th fret on the fourth string and the third string, so you get this, and then you hammer on the third finger the 13th fret on the fourth string, then back down to your bar, then hammer on again to the 13th fret, and then just the 11th fret on the third string. Now very pretty much the same rhythm as your earlier part but now 11 11 11 11 11 11 11 11 9 same kind of thing A little hammer on there 9 back to 11 then 9 8 9 8 now hammer on that's 9 hammer on to 11 on the fourth string and then 11 on the third string Okay, that's the first half. Back to here. This now, this part is a little different. Instead of just going, it goes. So 11, 13, 13, 11, 11, and then 11, hammer on to 13, up to 11 on the third string, down to 10 on the third string, and now this last riff, nine on the second string, hammer on to 11 on the second string, back down to nine, back to 11 on the third string, Nine on the second string, eleven on the third string, nine hammers on to eleven on the second string, and then nine on the first string, and you just do that. It's the whole solo. Have fun.